Micropipetters are an essential piece of equipment for any molecular biology and cell biology laboratory. These micropipetters are used to transfer small amounts of liquid. The small amounts of liquid range anywhere from about 0.5 microliters to 1,000 microliters or 1 ml. No matter where you purchase your micropipetter, fundamentally they are structurally the same. The parts of a micropipetter include the um, plunger button, which is used to draw up and discharge your sample, the tip ejector button, which is used to eject the tip after the use of the micropipetter, the volume adjustment knob, which is used to adjust the volume that you wish to transfer, the digital display window, which is used for to display what volume you will be transferring, the shaft, the ejector arm, which is very important in helping to eject the pipette tip, and then finally, the pipette tip itself. Because one should never exceed the limits of the pipetter, one generally has multiple pipetters available with volumetric ranges that range from 0.5 microliters to 1,000 microliters. Today, we are demonstrating two pipe, micropipetters. This particular micropipetter is referred to as a P200. If you look at the um, top of the plunger button, you will see that the range is between 20 microliters and 200 microliters. This means that the volume that you can transfer is anywhere between 20 and 200 microliters. You cannot exceed those limits. This particular micropipetter is called a P1000. That is because the range is between 100 microliters and 1000 microliters, or 1 ml. You will also notice that these different volume uh, micropipetters come with different tips. It is very important to make sure that you use the appropriate tip for a given micropipetter. 